Jen, so we're here uh, in Moscow for the World Championships. And you're competing in the pole vault, probably one of the most highly anticipated events of this championships. You know, how are you feeling? I'm feeling good. Um, coming into it, you know, there's a lot of nervous energy and anxiety about it. But once I got here, I, you know, I took a different approach and looked at it as, you know, this is a great opportunity. This is something that, you know, especially to be a part of, you know, to come into Elena's country, you know, where she's raised the standard of women's pole vault and to compete against her in her last meet. You know, that is really something special. And I've learned to embrace that and appreciate that part of it. So of course here we've got the indoor and the outdoor world record holders competing against each other. Uh, it's just going to be a really exciting competition, isn't it? It is. And you know, one thing that you hope for is everyone makes it through to the finals. Um, when you look at it, you have three girls that have jumped over 490 in this, and that's never been done before. So this is really a remarkable event that's being put together in, you know, in a country of a vaulter that's really made the event. So I mean, what more could you ask for? That, I mean, it's exciting. <laughs> Uh, your preparation coming into this event, are you feeling, you know, in the best p possible shape that you could be possibly be in to compete here? Yes, definitely. I've had really good training leading into this and, you know, I was able to execute some technical changes that I needed to and that's really, you know, made me believe, okay, there's a possibility that things could go well. Um, you know, I'm healthy. That's, I think that's the most important thing to ask for. So, I mean, it's really just day of and, you know, really putting it out there and seeing what you have. Now, the pole vault is such an exciting event. Um, do you think, do you think we might even possibly see some world record progression here? I mean, we've got fantastic competition. We're going to have a fantastic atmosphere in the stadium. What do you, what will, what is necessary to make that world record for again? You know, I do feel like something special is going to happen, and but I don't know what athlete. You know, that's the hard part. I hope it's me, but I don't know. And I do feel like there's a great energy going into this. And, you know, I think, you know, hopefully something remarkable is, you know, about to unfold here. And I don't know what it could be or what it is, but I'm excited to be a part of it. What's the atmosphere back like at the hotel, the whole team spirit? You know, how's that coming, bringing, pulling people together and getting excited together? Yes, um, you know, we were in Linz, Austria before this for the U.S. training camp, and that's the first time we ever went to a training camp. And, you know, it really was more of an atmosphere of a family, like a camaraderie, you know, and that's something that I really enjoy. I played team sports, and I don't really get that feeling anymore because this is all individual. So, you know, really it was a... a feeling of, okay, we need to come together, we need to pull for each other. And, you know, I like that, and I'm hoping that it carries into Moscow. You know, the, so, I mean, we've been here for, I think, two days now, and, you know, I think it's going good right now. I think the Team USA really has the morale up, and, you know, I think they're, they're ready to go after it.